Hi vlog, welcome back. This week we have another prep with me for a trip video. And if you're like, Doria, didn't you have one like two weeks ago? Yes, I did. Um, that was for New York. That was more of a, I don't want to say serious trip, but you know, this is for a vacation. I'm going to Jamaica in like a week. So I thought I'd take you guys along for the prep for that because we all know uh, the prep for actual vacation is pretty intense process <laughs> um yesterday i got my hair done i just like i didn't do much to be honest i just cut the ends because i mean it was really long and i loved it but i just need a little refresh because i think last time i went was like a year ago i want to say it's pretty rough but yeah and then i got more layers and i got these in front shorter but yeah right now it's not pretty fixed up because um it's the morning and yeah today's tuesday so last day last day yesterday was monday got my hair done and then i went shopping i'll put the videos on top of this i don't have like a lot of clips but went shopping went to two zaras but i didn't really find anything i wanted which is perfect because i don't really need anything right now i feel like i'm pretty good on winter stuff and i can't like it doesn't feel good feel good feel normal to buy spring things when it's like snowstorming outside so we're gonna hold off on the spring things just yet and i think i bought enough things for vacation so i don't really need to shop for that and then got home and i watched one day and yeah that's pretty much all i did and then today is tuesday i have laser today i'm doing my legs and then I'm gonna come home and I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, but yeah, that's the trip. Going to Jamaica in a week. Obviously, that vlog is gonna come the week after. Just stay tuned. Um, yeah, also this week, every single day I have something. Wednesday I have an event, Thursday I have a shoot, and Friday I have to go fix my nail. I like broke this one. In New York when I was changing my shoes and it was totally my bad but I'm like pissed off so I'm gonna go change it um, well more like fix it um, on Friday and then I'll see what else I have but yeah that's the summary of this video for you I just got back from laser and uh, this is a glamorous fit of a Canadian girly aka I had to walk there because it's close by I mean I didn't have to but I walked there because it's close by and um my hands are frozen and i literally feel like i sound different like sick but i am not but yeah laser was good today i did legs it was my second session last time i did um armpits and bikini area and it was it was an experience and i have to do it like so many more times so every time i'm gonna go i'm just gonna mentally prepare myself that it's gonna be an experience but yeah um just got done with laser it's like 1 p.m it took like an hour and yeah i'm not sure what i'm gonna do i i just posted on insta so i posted late but i couldn't like take my phone during the session so it is what it is came back from laser um and then i made some food and well more so heated up some food that i had from yesterday but ate um watched the love island finale I don't even know if any of you watch it, but all I'm gonna say is that I kind of expected the outcome, but I'm like, I was a little, I was unsure. But anyways, I I love Love Island. I will watch every single version of it. So yeah, did that. Then I did the dishes. Then I washed some clothes by hand, which I hate doing, but I have to wash my like lululemon and whatever delicate things that i don't trust to put in the washer because my things always shrink and that drives me insane even though i don't dry them anyways it's a story for another time uh so i did that wash those clothes and now i'm just cleaning around i'm gonna make some tea and i have this well we have i live with my parents by the way i think everyone knows that but just in case you don't this bar cart that we bought um i want to say a month ago and I've kept saying that I was going to deal with it because I am the one who wanted to buy it in the first place. Not that we're like that into drinking anyways, but I just wanted a set a corner in our dining room and I have not dealt with it. So I need to fix this situation. 
and then I need to take out the flowers from last week or the week before actually but yeah I've just been cleaning around um, and it's almost 5 p.m. so I'll, the lighting is beautiful and this is my I also have to deal with this so I have to deal with a lot of cleaning things but yeah it's not that exciting not anything trip related but still thought I'd get, let you know what I've been up to so far today taking a break from being productive because I just want to enjoy having a cup of tea and yeah I feel like I've done enough for the day um I need to plan out some content I need to shoot a YouTube video tomorrow I can't forget to do that because it needs to go up on Thursday and I don't even know like if you want to see something from me like a specific type of video please let me know because I have this trip coming up in a week ish but after that I don't have any trips planned which is sadness I'm sure I'm gonna plan more but I don't have like trip content coming soon so uh, I need suggestions of what you want you guys want to see because obviously I want to make videos that you guys actually want to see um, but yeah I think that's it for today I'm gonna go finish probably finish I was at episode 7 last night the show one day and yeah tomorrow I'm filming my YouTube vid I don't know if I'll shoot before that for this vlog but Anyways, I have an event, so I'm taking guests to that. So I shall see you tomorrow. Just got ready. I honestly had no idea what to wear because it's a wellness event and I know we're getting something done. So I, I didn't really know what to put on, but I just put on this cute, very, very light. It's not that cold outside. It's like the hottest day of the week. It's like three degrees. So yay. This light sweater and then this mini skirt from Zara and then I'm wearing tights why so bad i'm gonna put the zara big full fur coat on and then i'm gonna drive so i don't want to put these on right now but my right i literally tried on like four different pairs of shoes so i was like let me not wear the same shoes all the time um those are just the ones that match the fit the best so it's gonna have to be those ones but yeah it's a wellness event it's at the sense hotel downtown i've been at one of their I mean, I guess, yeah, I guess it was one of their events. Um, I've been at an event there previously. It was an F1 event in last June, and it's a really cute hotel. So I'm going to take you guys along, obviously. And it fits the theme of the week, which is wellness. So I'm going to catch you guys probably after the event. So roll the clip of the event. from Thursday I have my shoot today I woke up at 8 which I never really do anymore so I'm a little bit like which isn't even that early granted but I just don't wake up at 8 anymore because I always go to sleep at like 2 um so yeah we had the event yesterday at the Sense Hotel it was cute it was wholesome you guys saw what I did so I'm gonna skip over the details but yeah it was a cute wellness the theme of this week is really self-care <laughs> I didn't even plan that out but yeah and then Today I have the shoot, it's with a local company from Montreal, so it's just like small, something small. It's only snowing outside, so, um, but yeah, I'm gonna help them shoot. I literally put on a sweater and some jeans because I had no idea what to wear, but obviously I'm not shooting this, so it doesn't really matter. And then I have to go edit the vlog for today because it's gonna go up late, unfortunately, because I couldn't edit it yesterday. I got back home later than I expected, so shoot edit and then i don't know you'll see i guess just finished the shoot it was really quick i didn't get that much footage it was like an hour and a half it was for this company called modesty 
and it was cute, I saw. I, I think I got some footage, so you would have seen the fit. But yeah, now I'm gonna go to Tommy Cafe and edit the video for today, and hopefully it, I can get it up with someone on time, because it's gonna stress me out if I don't. It is 5.30 on Friday, and I'm gonna go get my nail fix, just this singular one. The nail, my, that's my actual nail. It's like pretty dead, that's why the other, and it was really short, so that's why the actual um, fake nail didn't stick onto it, and I didn't even realize when it fell off. But apparently it's not a New York trip unless I lose a nail, so <laughs> gonna go get that fixed. It shouldn't take too long, and yeah, my nails are not gonna be like outgrown enough for me to change them until I go on this trip, so I'm just gonna leave them. Hopefully no other ones fall off and if they do fall off, hopefully I see because that's never happened before normally like my actual nail will fall off before the fake one but anyways, it's because my actual nail is struggling I guess that it's literally half of it is dead I'm gonna need to take a little break from doing nails after because I feel like my actual nails are really rough under but yeah, I'm gonna go fix it. It's not gonna take long and then I think I'm gonna go meet up with Diney and then we're gonna chill in like a food court or something because we don't want to go out to actually eat and it's too cold to just roam the streets like we normally would do. So, so we're gonna hang out. Um, the things you do to see your friends when there's nothing to do in the city. Yeah, and we don't feel like going clubbing. Like, we're, we're not going there. But yeah, I think the next time I'm gonna talk to you guys is probably when I actually start picking out outfits so I'm not sure when that's gonna be but that's the plan for tonight and obviously I'm taking you guys along to my nails so you're gonna see my nails look cute again hello from Thursday the last few days I have been running around trying to get everything done obviously I feel like there's not enough hours in the day to get everything that I always want to get done before a trip but it is what it is. I'm gonna go pick up some sunglasses from this company that I always work with on my trips. They are called Claire Vision and they're in Montreal. They have two stores and they have literally every single sunglass, sunglass, a pair of sunglasses that you could ever need. So yeah, I tend to work with them on my trips. And since I'm leaving literally tomorrow, I figured like I'd just drop by and get some. And then I started packing today. I didn't really put anything in my suitcase, just like Kind of planning out what outfit i'd want i'm not really like a stressed person when it comes to packing i always pack the night before so or a few hours before so yeah that's why i haven't really been filming the last few days because i've just been doing other errands and stuff but i'll show you guys what i pack later or like the thought process like i always do in these videos i feel like this is the most common video on my channel right now prep with me for my trips and it's kind of the same thing so i'll keep it short this time i promise Okay, I'm back home and I have progressed with the packing. It's like 8 p.m. So I'm like doing good. Let me show you. I'm never going to bore you guys with like the whole packing process because I feel like I do a prep with me for a trip every two weeks at this point. So just watch my old videos and then you'll see like the extensive process. But basically, I have, I plan all my outfits like day and night just because I want to know like what I have content wise. So these ones are all night fits and it's mostly dresses because I feel like for vacation that's the easiest to style and like obviously it doesn't take up much room so dresses are prioritized and then these ones are like day pieces some of them are more like fancy I guess like this like I'm not sure where I'm wearing this but the rest are all like random things to just throw on top of my bathing suits for like beach days but then if you're thinking that's all you are wrong i have all of this um here these are day fits random extras like basics those are all workout clothes because your girl is still on her workout grind i'm breaking that bag for the beach of course and then these ones are the other night fits but yeah i'm gonna sort through these 
and see if I like want to bring all of them. I'm planning on putting everything into packing cubes, so that's like also sorry for like all the random stuff. That's like all donations. Um, yeah, I'm gonna see if I really want to put all this because obviously it took me two hours just to sort through the clothes that I want to bring, and then we got the luggage that I always bring. You guys know it already carry on and then my long shawl bag that i've had for years i have three different ones and they're my ride or die when i travel especially to the beach you just throw it in the wash after to get all the sand off of it and it's perfect <laughs> no don't mind these because these ones i'm not bringing but all of these i am bringing and if you're thinking dora this is seven days yeah i know but i like to be prepared i'm bringing like sneakers obviously for waking out only one pair and then stilettos shorter ish heels and then the black version and then these are very comfortable flats three because why not and then that's for the hotel room those are wedges you know because of vacation and yeah love the fit <laughs> it's looking like a disaster but i promise it's an organized mess and then i have the bathing suits and everything that i'm gonna put in packing cubes because it's easier and am I missing something? Oh, I'll show you guys in two seconds the sunglasses I got because they're pretty cool. And yeah, obviously makeup, skincare, but like you guys know already what products I use, so I don't want to make this video unnecessarily long because I'm sure it's already way too long knowing me. But yeah, let me show you the glasses I got. So like I said, I work with this sunglasses company. I guess they're like glasses in general, but I take sunglasses. So I don't need prescription glasses. Claire Vision from Montreal. Check them out love them have always well for the last year <laughs> i've worked with them for like all my trips and i got three pairs this time and let me show you we got these dior ones i think they're don't mind the lighting excuse sorry i have like a flashing light in front of me um i think they give cool kids they're kind of giving i don't know why it reminds me of fast and furious maybe because it's like the 90s vibe i could be completely wrong because i'm a 2000s baby but um that's what they make me think of. I think they're cool. And then we got these ones from Fendi. These are so bold. I really vibe with them. They're way more out there than normally, obviously with the huge Fendi on the side, but I think they're cool. And then the last ones are from Versace and they give the same vibe as the Celine one that everyone has but I think these ones are cooler <laughs> this looks so ridiculous with the light but yeah you're gonna see them during my trip anyways but yeah that's the glasses and I'm bringing them my trip obviously shooting content with them because that's what I work with them for and I'm gonna bring books because your girl is also in her reading era and hopefully same. Hopefully I don't forget anything. I don't think I am. I also have to shoot something for Pandora. Can't forget that. Me saying this so I can watch this back and like remember as if I'm gonna watch it back tonight. Um, and then bags. And then I think that's it. So this has been this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for, actually I should say, thank you for watching my 37th prep with me for a trip video in the past year. Um, but yeah, travel content is my my pride and joy. So I feel like I always want to show you guys the behind the scenes of how I prep for my trips. I feel like also this trip has been way more extensive. There's been a lot of self-care. Um, um, it's not always like that. But yeah, I was going to show you my nails, but you've seen my nails. That's how long I've been filming this video for. I think it's been like two weeks. Anyways, peace out. Love you guys. Thank you for watching. I will see you in next week's video, which I'm pretty sure is literally going to be the Jamaica trip. So, see you next week. <laughs>